Oh, yes. Oh, I see. Good news, everyone. Master Cam 2023 Update 1 is coming. Now, why does that matter? Uh, those that watched the video I did before this, I had a bit of an issue with some stock uh, positioning when using 2023. Uh, for me, it made using custom planes a bit of a pain and having to do some workarounds to get Mashcam to work the way that it used to work. Uh, so Mashcam has quickly addressed this issue and this update should be out very, very soon. It's in the beta testing process right now, so I wouldn't expect it to be there much, much longer since it seems to have caught uh, this feature and got it all updated. So yes, Mashcam 2023, I would say now is good to go. And if you've been holding off, I would go ahead and update now, but go ahead and watch the rest of this video and check out what's been fixed. Before we get into what was fixed, let's talk a little bit about what was actually broken. So this was typically only a problem on parts that were brought in and you're making custom planes uh, at that parts imported location. So you would create the plane and using the new Mastercam 2023 stock interface, you would select that plane as the stock plane, uh, do your bounding box, uh, define stock however you would want. When you accepted that, however, what would happen is your stock would be shifted out of position. Uh, so update one now to the rescue and same workflow, imported parts out in space. We make a plane out at that imported parts location. Uh, again, going through the new 2023 stock setup interface. Uh, however, this time our stock remains at the defined location. So no more issues with stock on custom planes, no more needing to do little workarounds. Everything's working as it should. So if this was something that's holding you back from updating to 2023, uh, you can now feel confident moving forward and being able to now experience those new features that 2023 has in store for you.